Variety reports that Matthew McConaughey will star in the comedy Beach Bomb with Spring Breakers Helmer Harmony Corinne writing and directing. The movie will follow the hilarious misadventures of Moondog, a rebellious and lovable rogue who lives life large. In the press release, producer John Lesher said that director Harmony has crafted the perfect movie for our dark and serious time and called it a refreshingly original, irreverent, and hilarious stoner comedy. Principal photography is scheduled to begin in July with a release date yet to be determined. Shanat Byers saw the stoner comedy with Beach Bomb, Beach Bomb with Matthew McConaughey. Uh, this is a big buy for me. It feels like it's just an autobiography of Bongo <laughs> Man himself, McConaughey. It's like... You know, a lot of people are saying it's the end of the reconnaissance. I think this is just the, the, the second chapter of the re-beginning <laughs> of the reconnaissance. Harmony Corinne's an incredible director from Gummo all the way to Spring Breakers. The guy's got talent. He takes risks. He does things off the cuff. He makes weird films. I'm 100% into seeing Moondog's Adventures. Jeremy. Reconnaissance Rebirth. That's what we're going to call this. <laughs> no, I mean, Matthew McConaughey in his stoner comedy where he plays a beach bum. This is like Christmas for me. I want to see mm. Matthew McConaughey be a a big man child like bro uh like Bodie from uh, from point break but just given less of a shit i think that's fantastic i think mcconaughey's the guy to do it mcconaughey can be that character and play a series dude has a wide range of roles up there in his head uh i think if anyone can pull that off he can i'm looking forward to this for sure christian this goes back to what we were talking about before with this whole star wars spoof is that when you tell me there's certain people that are doing certain movies i'm either on board because of that creator or i'm not Harmony Crinton, this guy, I hated Spring Breakers. For the first hour, I hated it, and it, it flipped me on my head at the end because it was so bizarre, it was so strange, that I wound up really liking it. I understand that some people, if you say, I couldn't stand that movie and I hated it, I get it. It's not for everybody. But I wound up really enjoying it. I thought it brought a, a, a great performance out of James Franco, one of his best. You know, look at my shit. There's just so much <laughs> great stuff in that yeah. movie. And I want to see McConaughey working with this dude to do that because if you just said oh he's doing another he's just doing a stoner comedy and then kate hudson's gonna show up you're like oh no why are we back here but i don't think this is gonna be this i think it's gonna be something something's gonna happen to him in this stoner comedy this is gonna be like pineapple express type stuff times 10 yeah. so for that i'm buying